How's it going, subscribers? Today we're going to be talking about the company and the stock NEO. NEO. So we know that NEO right now is currently priced at $4.42. And that's a decline of 3.9%, uh, 17 cents decrease. Now, when we when we're to rate Neo out of five stars, we're going to be giving Neo a two two stars out of five. And here's why we, we're going to rate Neo two stars out of five. And remember, just because we're giving it a two star out of five does not mean that um, I'm against Neo. I'm actually a, a supporter of Neo, and I'm actually an, an investor of Neo. I believe in the CEO. And then the CEO's ability to bring this company to the top. Anyways, um, th I'm just going over one perspective in this video with you guys. I, I like to share many different perspectives with you guys. And I like to compare many different technical um, aspects and figures and charts with you, with you guys. Just so you guys can see the company in a different perspective. So anyways... When it comes to Neo, Neo has strong growth, strong growth, growth potential. So this is this is a good thing when it comes to Neo. The other good thing about Neo is that Wall Street, Wall Street believes that Neo, um, there's an upside potential to Neo. Like they they pretty much they value uh, Neo way higher than what it is right now. You know, the four dollars and forty-two cents. So these two are good signs. Now um, I'm just gonna go be going over some of the negative aspects. Now, one bad sign about Neo is the fact that uh, it's expensive compared to its competitors. When you uh, when you look at its PE ratio and you compare it to other corporations similar to, um, you know, in the same sector, and so it's expensive. And then the other aspect when it comes to Neo is the earnings per share. It's way in the negative range. And so this is also, um, I mean, we know this. This is also same news with Tesla. So we know these same news with Uber and Lyft. These companies are just going to lose money in the short term. But this doesn't mean that they're going to always be losing money. And another bad thing about Neo, I mean, this one is not a huge deal, not a big deal, um, is the fact that Neo doesn't pay dividends. We usually we like to see companies paying dividends to its shareholders, you know, and um, healthy dividends, dividends that they can afford, that their earnings per sh that, that their earnings could actually pay pay for. So Neo doesn't, of course, have that. So that's uh, I mean, it makes sense. They they couldn't even afford it, so it makes sense. But anyways, like we usually like to see dividends. Dividends is always a good sign. Um, but we can see here Neo, it's declining. Um, it's been declining lately. Uh, Neo was down 2.7. Let's go. Uh, let, let's uh, look at other. So now look at the 52 week range subscribers. Neo's low is four dollars and forty-two cents, and its high is at three uh, thirteen dollars and eighty cents. And we know that it's in the electrical industry. All right, there you guys have it. Thank you guys for watching, and see you guys next time.